So, how is everyone? I hope you're all well. So, if I say the name Francisco Oropesa, I think that's how you say it. And if I'm brutally honest, that piece of shit doesn't deserve me to take the time to make sure that the pronunciation is right. And you guys know that pronunciation is my forte. But look, he is the gunman who has gone on the run. That's it. He's up sticks and fucked off into the ether after a mass shootout in Texas where he has turned his gun on his neighbours that resulted in multiple deaths, including that of a young eight-year-old. And look, this is... ah, This is not the first. It's not the last. It's going to be more. And this is an ongoing debate regarding gun laws. And it's one that I am not going to get involved in. I daren't, because at the end of the day, the, the situation in the United States of America is very different to here in the UK. Gun laws are different. But what I can say is, despite what the law dictates and what the law says... People are still monsters, and if they want to get hold of a weapon, they will get hold of a weapon regardless of the law. And that's not necessarily, and this is purely my opinion, purely my opinion. And my opinion is nothing on the grander scheme of things. It's just one person who's got something to say about a situation. And look, my interpretation of the situation is that people in general are getting worse. And that's not just adults, that is anything from the youngsters of today, the teenagers today, bullying and the way that people are behaving towards one another is getting worse. And that's what needs to be tackled. It's very, very easy to point the finger and say this is where the problems lie. It's the gun laws and where the, that's where the problem lie. But ultimately I do not believe that that is Look, it may help, it may reduce them if guns all of a sudden got whitewashed across the board and they got taken away, but it's one of those things, isn't it? Why should the masses suffer because of the minority? And there's something that you're almost taught from a young age. Look, it's unfair for people in general to be punished because of the acts of the few. And you may argue that it gets to the point when enough is enough, but... <sighs> That's an argument that has to be had by the people that can make changes and make a difference. And that, sadly, is not me and is likely to never be me. But look, this guy is out. He is armed and dangerous and he is on the run and he needs to be found. Is there going to be any way that we can stop things like this happening? Who knows? But for now... Let's just pray that this guy is brought in, authorities do their job, they find him and no one else is hurt. Thank you. Just a short one today and I shall catch you all in the next one. What's up, Harsh fam? We just launched our new nonprofit organization, United Search Corps. We're going to be advocating for the missing and families of the missing as well. And we need your help to spread awareness for our mission and also our fundraiser. There's a lot of equipment and necessary things that we need for this to be possible. So please take a second and share our fundraiser. For more information, please check out our website, unitedsearchcorps.org. Go over, my, go over to my YouTube channel and check out our announcement video as well. The links will be in the description below. Thank each and every one of you for your time and consideration. Thank you.